fighters, but my brothers, man, you niggas ain't no kidding. That's a fact. Hey. All right. Let's give it a quick second. Let that copyright cool off for a second. You know what I mean? Let that mute cool off. Because you know they're going to mute that part of the stream. I don't want anything to be missed, to be honest. We could have healthy discourse. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and you know, talk about some things that are going in, in the scene. So, okay, here we are. Let's pull up some pages here. I feel like I haven't fucking talked about fucking Toronto news and stuff like that for more than a week. Well, it's not what I feel like. It's what happened. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, what's going on with 40? Hey, who's that? Nigga bought it back to the old school 40. Legends, league, gear, all them type of thing. Jesus Christ. Who's that? Nigga got the extra baggy jeans on. You know what I'm saying? Looking like he's ready to fucking go pull up on a motherfucker. Pick up the 40, yo. That's my dog. That's my dog. Um, let's see. Where do we start? Where do we start? Where do we start? Do we go to the hood six first? Because I know they got the T. You know what I'm saying? They be saying that them niggas is on payroll. I don't really want to start with the... Um, the Doobie, um, Rolex, and what you, what you gonna call it? Watchbusters, or is that the name the name of the of the Instagram page? Watchbusters. Hmm. Right. Well, we'll get to that. My apologies also to the people out there for no podcast this week. You know what I'm saying? Salute to everybody who supports us, all the people who've been supporting us from day one, all of our listeners, okay? Um, I'm, I'm really, really, really serious about our audience out here, and I, and I really make sure to, that we keep on feeding you all good content, you know what I'm saying? No matter what's going on, it's really, 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 really important to me that we keep consistent and, like, keep on giving y'all content because when you start doing something consistently, people start depending or not depending, but like they start looking forward, let's say to seeing the content and the thing that you're bringing to them consistently. You know what I'm saying? So when now like we built this thing that we have here, the We Love Hip Hop Network, you know, the We Love Hip Hop podcast on episode, going into episode 241, which would have dropped this week. When we don't drop, I feel it. I know the audience out there, the people who are in their offices, who might be listening to us to pass the time, people who are cleaning their crib, who, who will be listening to the man them while, they, you know, catch some jokes while they're cleaning up the crib, doing whatever they do in life. You know what I'm saying? You might be fucking driving on a long trip and you want to listen to a two hour podcast and we got a slapper of an interview that's in there that you could listen to as well as the jokes that, that the man them have and our perspectives on what's going on in the scene. But when that don't happen, I know that the audience member is like, fuck. They go to the Spotify, they go to whatever, you know, YouTube and they're like, yo, well, go on, there's no new episode. I know that feeling because I feel the same way about podcasts and different programs that I fuck with heavy. You know what I'm saying? So when that happens, even though I know you all feel it as an audience, no cap, I feel it more. I'm like, damn, I wish I fucking did an episode for the man them or, and for the gal them. You know what I'm saying? Like, so that like, there's something to, to, to help pass the day. You know what I'm saying? And I appreciate that we're part of people's days. You know what I'm saying? That we've become part of some people's lives as far as like things that they, you know, we've become part of their routine, their weekly, daily routine, whatever it is. To me, that is a fucking blessing. And to all y'all, even if there's one of y'all in the common gang right now in the, on this Twitch, you know what I mean? This shit gets pushed, pushed back up on YouTube and all that good stuff. I appreciate y'all, okay? Just y'all know that. I appreciate y'all, the audience, for, um, for supporting us, you know what I mean? You could be watching anything else you wanna watch on the internet, but you watch us, you know what I'm saying? So to me, that's a big fucking deal. So salute. Um, 
So let's go back here. Let's go back. <laughs> we covered a lot of this stuff last week, so I wasn't gone for too, too long. We got to the Casper stuff. Salute to Casper. He's, he's, he, there's rumors that he's home right now. Let's talk about the Tollop Twins interview, or Tollop Twin interview. So that went down. Big salute to two time. We pulled it off last night. One on one interview with your boy Friday Ricky Dread. Um, it was a really, really dope interview. We got to talk about a lot of different things. Okay. Um, right now, I haven't even gotten to the edit part of it yet, but the audio is available right now. I could play you a little bit of the audio. Um, I mixed the audio down last night, but I felt like that conversation that I had with him he got to really show a different side of him in that conversation because a lot of times we'll watch these guys in their music videos and stuff like that and the things that they say in their raps and we'll be like yeah 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 these guys are demons they're demons they don't give a fuck about life they don't give a fuck about nothing but man them have feelings man them have different things that they go through you know what i'm saying and 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 life experiences that you know make it hard to maneuver you know what i'm saying so i really really appreciated him being so candid with uh, candid with me and, and even pulling up to have the conversation because I think this is the only interview and RIP to, um, to 40 double um, his, his twin brother. I think this may be the only Talib twin interview period, unless somebody goes and gets an interview from him, um, before we publish this one, you know what I'm saying? But I think this is going to be the only one in existence. So I'll play y'all a little bit of the audio from it because to be honest, I want to wait till like the video is complete and everything like that. I want to be able to even let him um, catch a piece of the interview um, and take it in before I publish it. You know what I'm saying? Because he was very, very open with with the man. Then, you know what I'm saying? I play even like we. I play how we even intro the shit. <laughs> Oh yeah, so press the record that's on um, the screen there for, uh, you see the, the, the red record? And this is the raw, raw, raw audio. So this is before I cut it down and actually cut it to the intro. So you're hearing all yeah, the yeah, stuff yeah. before we even get to talking, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mic check. <laughs> so, um, you see how you hear yourself in the mic? Yeah. So always talk back to the mic. I don't want to be there. Good. Two zeros at the end. Move this shit around. Page of out. Tile up turn. You done now. Okay. And we got a spell. I'm going to be looking to this questions in my phone. So when you see me looking out in my phone, it's not because I'm like, uh, I'm not paying attention. It's because I'm loading up my next question in my brain. All right. No problem. Um, everybody else, phones off, please. Or phones on silence, I mean. Super behind the scenes. Yeah, yeah. Okay. It's good. Yeah, you know my thing? You ready? Two zeros at the end. Mm -hmm. All right, let's start the shit. We, 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 we love hip hop. Oh. Special one today. A bar, a bar. Hey. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's the new heater for the streets right now. Memories. Memories out on YouTube. Go search that up. Subscribe to my YouTube page of all. Tile up turn. You don't know. Okay. And we got a special one we over love, here we, today. We, we, we love you know what I'm saying? We Salute to everybody up. who's tuning in right now in the listening audience as we well as our viewing up. audience. Um, all that YouTube shit. Make sure to subscribe and subscribe like and up. share and all that shit. You know what I'm saying? But I want to get straight to the business. Yeah, I've, yeah. You know, I, I've been watching this man's career. I've been watching the whole collective you know what i'm we saying are, the team we, 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 and, and y'all been doing a lot of big things but like i'm watching videos on youtube millions of views and i'm like yo how could i get in contact with this guy you know what i'm saying yeah, yeah. I, I seen you shout out to me on my Instagram. i'm like all right yeah fuck this is the time for us you know mm -hmm, mm -hmm. i'm like yeah this is the time for us i'm just like yo and I was really thinking about it. I'm like, ah, this might be a good opportunity still, you know? Yeah, to, yeah. For my fans too as well, because people ask a lot of questions about me. You know, I got a, a lot of fans too, like, mm -hmm. that message me all the end shit, but they don't really know me like that, you know? Yeah. And I, I Listen, yo. 
I'm a big audio guy, you know what I'm saying? Even though, like, right now, sometimes the audio isn't the best on Twitch, okay? Don't get me wrong. I'm not, like, I haven't mastered the OBS stream to my fucking mixer, to these microphones to make it crispy, crispy. But what I do, when I do, it's going to be a fucking problem. However, when it comes to this podcast and shit, when I get a couple of people to sit down in a room and put a camera around or whatever, I don't give a fuck if we're recording in a cave. I'm going to sauce that bitch up. Trust me. Let's continue. I want to be like interacting with my fans and shit, you know? Yeah. Obviously, they can't know too much and shit, but like, you know, you got to. Well, this, this, this also like, and I feel like even behind the scenes, we kind of had this conversation, things like this. And, and for the people who, who don't know in the listening audience, because people on YouTube are like, a lie, yeah, yo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm I was like, ooh, like, you know what I'm trying to say? Then we're like, yeah. What's that like when you're on road, fam? Do people like, when that first started happening, where people like, yo, walk on tall up twins, yo. Wait, wait, like, wait, what? When people bump into you, because fam, we don't have millions of views on our, yeah, on yeah, our content. Yeah, and yeah. I get, I get recognized every day fam yeah, yeah so yeah. you got it's millions like, of views on your shit you know yeah, what I'm saying? yeah for sure but i don't really even like i'm out here but like i don't be out in like the public eye and shit like you know mm. what i'm trying to start the way and shit to be really honest with you yeah you know what i'm trying to say but yeah when i see people and shit like sometimes when i go to mall and shit people see me and ask for pictures and shit too so mm-hmm. it's like it's kind of funny as shit i kind of find it funny but i keep a straight face and shit you know yeah, what i'm trying to say yeah but yeah yeah yeah, I keep a straight face and shit. Yo, yo, yo. Sorry, hold it down back there. Yeah, mm, My bad. Yeah, I keep a straight face and shit, you know, but mm. like, yeah, I find it pretty, you know, but I'm kind of used to it and shit, you know, but that's why I don't really go out and shit. I do online shopping, I do little shit, but like, I'm yeah. out and shit, you know, I go out to eat and shit. Yeah. Like, shit like- yo, we talked about some real shit in that interview, yo. Like, we didn't even just stick, stick to like, oh, where did you grow up and uh, how did you get into music? Like, we talked about like his like basketball, like, in, Gal them like everything fam like a real real conversation you know what i'm saying so look out for that dropping real 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 soon you know what i'm saying uh let's see what's going on in the comments here they posted your top 30 on six buzz for real uh salute to six buzz yo salute to the whole team over there yo i appreciate them you know what i'm saying i know they're gonna get at me for the list <coughs> and then we're gonna get to it but yeah, before that, yeah, big salute, big salute, big salute to Talib Twin. You know what I'm saying? Um, his name has evolved from just two time or Talib Twin two time to Talib Twin. You know what I'm saying? So you could look for him on, on any social media platform just under Talib Twin. Right? RIP to 40 00 once again. We had conversation about um, his passing as well. It, you know, it's a very touchy subject. However, we, you know, I made sure that we did touch on it. Um, I'm very sensitive when it comes to speaking speaking with our with our guest when it comes to certain things i'm not going to be here to be the, the interviewer that tries to make a salacious headline from somebody you know what i'm saying i just want the person to be able to tell their story in the way that they want to tell it all right so when that interview drops make sure make sure to go check it out you know what i'm saying i, I feel like he's a pretty 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 popular person in this in this toronto hip hop scene and um yeah um Jesus Christ, you guys want me to get to this list so bad. 